G'day guys, Dilly Dog here. Now today we have some massive leaked information about the upcoming event for Halloween in 2021. Now we do have a lot of leaked information to go through and with a lot of leaked information we have a lot of data miners to give credit for in today's video. Now the data miners I have to give credit for in today's video are Garrett, Shrugtool and Rindo. All their links will be in the description below guys and make sure to go check them out for yourselves. Now first off, this Halloween event is going to be massive. So let's get to the first piece of information here, which Shrugtool has said will be a 40 item thematic event over three weeks with three free trackers. 40 items, including 15 trackers, some charms, banners, poses, and etc. Now here are some of the bigger prizes that will be coming with the trackers. And we also have five legend trackers to go through, which are coming with this event, which include trackers for Bloodhound, Caustic, Seer, Loba, and Revenant. Now you can see in the trackers here, they have some skins, which are not in the game at the moment. However, of course, we have some new skins coming with this event. So now let's take a look at the 2021 Halloween skins. So first off, we have some epic skins, which include skins for Horizon, Valk, Loba, Gibraltar, and finally Wraith. Now Wraith also has a new banner frame which matches the theme of her skin. Now we also have four legendary skins and four matching banner frames to come with this Halloween event, which are for Bloodhound, Seer, Revenant, and finally Caustic. Now me as a Caustic main, I bloody love this skin for Caustic. Now finally we have three legendary weapon skins to go through, which include skins for the Hemlock, the R99, and the Spitfire. Now don't worry guys, this is not just a store event because we also have some information in the files about the fan favorite Shadow Royale mode returning. Now I don't know if it's just me who feels this way, but why does the 2021 Halloween event look so much better than the next two weeks of this collection event? I mean, there's not really anything to do in game at the moment, but anyway, maybe that's just my thoughts on this subject. But now let's move over to the roadmap for the dates we can expect for the rest of the season. So this has been provided by Shrugtool. On the 28th of September, we'll have the Bloodhound lore event start. Then after that, we have the Monsters store event, which will start at the 12th of October. And throughout that event, the Season 11 map teasers will start on the 14th of October. And the 18th of October, we'll have more teasers, which are likely for Season 11. And finally, the Shadow Royale game mode will start on the 26th of October. And Crow Rindo has said that the Shadow Royale event will end on November the 2nd, which will be a one-week event. And at the conclusion of the Shadow Royale event, Season 11 will start. Now, finally, guys, we have some badges for the 2021 Halloween event. But it does seem that two of the three weeks, you'll have to complete arena challenges. But I do think the second half of Season 10, we have a lot of content to look forward to, which I think we can all say is an awesome thing for us Apex fans. But for now guys, let's move into the question for the video, which is what is your favorite skin to come with the upcoming Halloween event? Now obviously mine is Caustic, but let me know your thoughts down below. But that is all from me guys. Make sure to like the video and subscribe if you're not new to the channel for the quickest and straight to the point Apex content. But anyway guys, Dilly Doll will catch us all later.